All right, people. I believe everybody is doing great, nice, and absolutely fine. Is NEET 2025 going to be the toughest NEET exam ever? Question number one. Are they going to introduce the new pattern of questions like previously we used to see uh, we had the statement based questions, a surgeon reason questions, okay? Match the following questions. Now in NEET 2025, are they going to introduce the new pattern of questions? This is the question number two. Guys, let me just tell you something. In order to get 700 plus in your NEET exam, it's not only you just have to complete your syllabus. It's not only you have to get the good marks in your test series, okay? That is also mandatory. I would say extremely mandatory. But there are some other points also if you want to come under AIR 10, under AIR 10, okay? So what are those points? That is, that is, you should know, is the exam going to be the toughest? Is this exam going, what will be the difficulty level of this exam? You should know before itself, what pattern of questions has the maximum probability that they can introduce in the NEET 2025. So there are other parameters also, which you need to keep in your mind in order to boost your rank, in order to come AIR 10. okay? Are there any other questions which we have to solve so that we can come under AIR 10? Like, like I used to say, when it comes to your physics exam, Okay, listen, when it comes to your physics paper, they generally ask the questions from the NCRT. Okay, maximum number of questions are from the NCRT. But two to three questions they give you which are having the deep conceptual understanding, which are having the extreme level, we say, uh, conceptual uh, uh, concepts involved in that particular question. So those students who solve those two questions will get 700 plus in their NEET examination or even in the JE mains also they follow the same because see guys they have to decide the AIR 1 AIR 1 means or they have to decide decide the AIR from 1 to 10 means they have to decide those students which are the stars so in order to take the stars from 24 lakh students so they have to give some questions which have got the extreme level conceptual understanding okay so that's the reason they ask few questions you, if you follow those questions, means you can cross 700 plus mark, okay? So in this, but this video is very important for all the neat aspirants out there. I will be telling you, based on the data and analysis, analysis, okay? It's not I'll be telling you something else and all. So proof I'll be putting in front of you. And based on that analysis and data, okay, we will be seeing what is going to be the difficulty level of NEET 2025, okay? So my dear friends, Listen to me very, very, very carefully. Let's first take a look at the number of registrations, okay? So if we talk about NEET 2021, we say 16 lakh students appeared in the NEET 2021 exam. Okay, and when it comes to the NEET 2022, we say 19 lakh students appeared in the NEET 2022 exam. 20 lakh, 21 lakh students appeared in 2023, 24 lakh students appeared in 2024, and, and, when it comes to your NEET 2025, my dear friends, we are expecting, we are expecting a huge, we say, huge number of students which are going to appear. That is 27 to 27, 26 to 27 lakh students. And this is expected, okay? Because every single year we have been seeing that there is an increase of 2 to 3 lakh students. So here also, you can expect that 27 lakh students may appear in your NEET 2025 exam. So more the number of students, so the competition increases. If competition increases, we say cutoff increases, okay? As simple as that, as simple as that. So we say the difficulty, if, if cutoff increases, means the difficulty level of exam automatically increases. Now, now, if we talk about the overall or we say the year-wise difficulty level, okay, we'll be saying what was the difficulty level of NEET exam in 2021, what was the difficulty level of NEET exam in 2022, 2023, okay? So the first thing which I would like to tell you in this particular case is, let's take a look at the difficulty level of NEET 2024, which recently happened, okay? See, difficulty level is mentioned over here. We say easy, medium, and a difficult. Now, now, percentage of questions. If we talk about the percentage of questions in NEET 2024, so we say 35.3% were easy questions, okay? And medium type of questions were 
we say 46.3 percent and difficult questions were 18.4 percent this is the overall difficulty you can see over here okay this is the overall difficulty analysis over here now my dear friends now my dear friends in this particular case in this particular case listen to me very carefully listen to me very carefully if we talk about the need difficulty level 2024 subject wise see when it comes to the physics we say easy number of easy questions were 24 medium questions were 22 and difficult questions were 4 and total number of questions how many that were 50 similarly in chemistry you have got easy number of questions 16 in uh, medium uh, we were we said that it was uh, 24 and difficult were 10 exactly you can see from the botany portion also zoology portion also and overall difficulty analysis if we see over here that is 91 questions were extremely easy 84 were medium and 25 questions were we say we say the difficult questions okay and and now let's take a look at the difficulty level of 2024 versus 2023 first first see when it comes to the need 2023 we say it was moderate to difficult there are three categories the first one is easy moderate and difficult when it comes to the 2023 difficulty level it was between moderate to difficult and when it comes to a recent need 2024 it was easy to moderate okay the questions were extremely easy even from the physics perspective also i saw the questions which were directly the formula based okay just you have to put up one formula and get the answer and and distribution of questions was balanced okay it was not like some in some chapters you are getting much uh, questions but in some chapters you are you are getting few questions only okay no it was balanced okay so the first section was physics over here also physics over here also easiest section biology easiest section biology okay and ncrt based were questions exactly that you can see over here now now let me basically tell you when it comes to the 2024 so it was easy to moderate and overall difficulty level if we basically rate it in among three it was 1.25 only and similarly you can see over here when it comes to 2023 it was three to among uh, among three it was 1.34 was the difficulty level okay and you can see here also the difficulty level of we say 2023 now my dear friends if we take a look over here in 2022 we say it was overall difficulty was 1.69 out of three over here you can see the subject wise difficulty level like physics was 1.66 percent this was 1.9 percent 192 percent similarly similarly over here my dear friends if we take a look over here so we say in 2021 it was moderate it was moderate in 2021 it was moderate and and over here overall difficulty level in this particular case was also 1.49 out of 3 and here we say in 2020 it was easy okay so overall difficulty was we say 1.1.17 okay now the question is sir from this difficulty level what are you going to expect in need 2025 i simply say when it comes to the need 2025 we say number of students have been increasing every single year so this year there will be the increase of students okay and my dear friends, my dear friends, I can expect that in NEET 2025, the difficulty level will be between moderate to difficult. It will not be between easy to moderate, but it will be between moderate to difficult that we can expect uh, based on this analysis. Okay, because from past few years, they have been giving the easy paper. Now we are expecting they will give the from moderate to difficult uh, paper. Okay, now the question, main important question over here is, what is the role of NCRT in NEET 2025? Guys, see, Previously, we say 80 to 90 percent questions used to directly from NCRT. Even this year, we say 80 to 90 percent questions were directly NCRT based. No question out of NCRT. Just one or two questions uh, in physics were controversial questions in which we already discussed. Okay, so we say 80 to 90 percent are directly from NCRT. And when it comes to NEET 2025, there is a rough estimate. We say 70 to 75 quest percent questions we are expecting directly from NCRT. Okay. And, and most importantly, in this particular case, we say 25 to 30 percent questions will be the deep conceptual understanding. Okay, deep conceptual understanding questions. Okay, and 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 
we are saying this we are saying this because the difficulty level is going to increase okay and if you want to get 700 plus marks then you have to make your basics foundation very strong okay so then only you would be able to solve these type of questions okay this is easy by reading the ncrt and all you can solve these questions but in order to solve the questions which are from the deep conceptual understanding you should have a strong base you should have a strong foundation so that's the reason we say this you can expect in new training training five okay and most importantly my dear friends let's take a look at the question patterns we say mcq they ask every single year single correct and multiple correct okay and then we say statement based a surgeon reason matching questions all of this you have already studied you know this and then you have fill in the blanks or you have true false questions okay now the question is what is the expected question type they can ask in the NEET 2025 see see all of this these types of already you know now what is the new expected question type that you can expect in your NEET exam see that is we say that is we say text-based questions sir what is text-based question see it is like have you seen in the english subject they ask they give that summary okay from the summary then they ask the questions and then you have to answer those questions it is exactly like that okay it will be given a paragraph over here like this statement over here okay so you will have to read it completely and then you will have to basically answer these questions according to according to whatever is mentioned in the script over here so this is the text based questions i'm saying this has the probability that they can ask they can put up this in your neat exam okay maybe they'll put up this in the biology maximum chances are there okay and then data interpretation questions from biology over here so what is it you'll be given it some sort of table something like this okay okay and in this case data will be given and you just have to answer the questions you can read it properly from your end only and then you can basically answer this particular question then you can answer this particular question so this was all about it my dear friends so i can say from now onwards if you haven't started your preparation now okay so i say we are starting a batch in which everything whatever i mentioned over here everything will be discussed in that batch that is phoenix we say 2.0 this phoenix 2.0 it will be starting from today itself okay so i'll be taking the first class so wasim sir will be taking the first class so this is starting from today itself everything will be mentioned over here okay so whatever i told you all the syllabus comp everything syllabus completion everything we will be discussing i'll be completing your complete physics wasim sir complete chemistry and hsp sir ambika ma'am and pankuri ma'am they'll be taking the biology so whatever i told you all of this will be discussed in this particular batch okay the extreme level test series which we have designed personally that will be given to you study material dpps everything will be given to you so the link is in the description below i want you guys to join that okay so link click on to that link and uh, enroll in this particular batch because we are starting the classes from today itself okay so do not miss out these classes at any cost and there is a special session on youtube at uh, in the evening uh, by wasim sir so do not miss out that session also so take care and bye bye thank you so much take care